Celestica stock has been one of the biggest winners in the market, trading at $253 as of September 19th, 2025, just below its all-time high of $258. The question is, after this massive run, does CLS still have room to climb, or is it running too hot? Let's find out. Celestica is a global leader in electronics manufacturing and supply chain solutions. It partners with original equipment manufacturers across cloud and connectivity, aerospace and defense, healthcare and industrial markets. Unlike low-margin, high-volume players like Foxconn, Celestica focuses on high-reliability, specialized industries. That means stronger contracts, better margins, and longer-term customer relationships. One key point, Celestica is not a hyperscaler. Hyperscalers are companies like Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, and Google Cloud, the giants that run the world's largest data centers. Celestica doesn't compete with them. Instead, it supplies them, manufacturing servers, networking gear, and critical systems. So when hyperscalers ramp up AI and cloud spending, Celestica benefits indirectly as a trusted partner in the supply chain. The fundamentals back up the stock's rally. Q2 2025. Revenue up about 21% year-over-year, with both revenue and EPS beating Wall Street expectations. Management even raised forward guidance. On a trailing basis, Celestica runs near $10.6 billion in revenue and $538 million in net income, delivering about $4.60 in earnings per share. Over the past few years, net income growth has been in the double and sometimes triple digits. Right now, the stock trades around $253 in a $48 to $250 52-week range. That's a huge climb in just one year. But here's the concern, valuation. Celestica trades at about 54 times earnings, much higher than peers like Jabil, which sits closer to 15X. That tells us the market expects continued hypergrowth and leaves little room for disappointment. What's fueling the optimism? AI and cloud hardware demand. Hyperscalers are pouring billions into servers and networking for AI. Defense spending. Global defense budgets are rising, and Celestica's aerospace and defense unit benefits. Healthcare manufacturing. Medical device production offers high margins and sticky partnerships. Supply chain diversification. Companies want reliable North American partners, and Celestica fits the bill. But no rally comes without risks. Valuation risk. At 54x earnings, any earnings miss could trigger a sharp drop. Cyclicality. Cloud and networking spending can swing with the economy. Geopolitical risk. Supply chain exposure to Asia could be impacted by tariffs or trade tensions. Profit-taking. After such a big run, institutions may lock in gains. If you're already holding, it might make sense to ride the uptrend while using risk controls, like trailing stop losses. If you're looking to enter, consider staggered buys on pullbacks rather than chasing highs. Long term, if Celestica continues to scale in AI cloud, defense, and healthcare, it could evolve from a contract manufacturer into a high growth industrial tech powerhouse. So, what do you think? Can Celestica keep climbing alongside the AI and defense spending boom, or is it due for a correction? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if you found this breakdown helpful, hit the like button, subscribe for more stock market insights, and turn on notifications so you never miss the next analysis. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.